Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. All right, here's your forecast going through the evening. Mostly sunny skies at 8 o'clock, 78 degrees. Low 70s at 11 p.m. under mostly clear skies. Once again, a little patchy fog will be possible late night and into tomorrow morning, but quickly burning off in the morning. Should be mostly sunny at 8 o'clock, 69 degrees, and just some light north northeast winds at a, about 2 to 5 miles per hour as we start the day. And for a change, all clear on live Doppler 2 HD. A couple of blips on the radar there, just basically picking up some clouds drifting across uh, parts of green and also some. Montgomery County. So if the grass is looking like a hay field after all the rain we've had, well, some good news for cutting the grass Thursday and Friday. Uh, looks like the green light to go. And Saturday and Sunday, well, uh, getting back up there around the uh, caution uh, status because especially in the afternoon and evening hours, both those days, there will be the chance for some scattered showers and thunderstorms. No rainfall today for a change. Three and a half inches for the month. Again, there's some areas picked up three and a half inches in, in just a day or two here with some of the rain that's moved through, but this is a, our official reporting site at Dayton International Air, so Airport, pretty close to normal for the month and really only about an inch above normal for the year at Dayton International. Air quality good today at 47. Tree pollen low along with the grass, but the mold count remains high at over 21,000. And again, tomorrow the ultraviolet index will be very high up there around 9, so keep the sunscreen on. Uh, wear the uh, sunglasses, the hat, shade, try to stay indoors between 10 and 4, but if you have to be out, take all those precautions. Still seeing a few uh, those uh, scattered cumulus clouds around tonight, but certainly not the buildup uh, that we've seen the last couple of days, eventually leading to those scattered showers and thunderstorms. We're at 83 degrees now with light variable winds, 3 miles an hour, and a heat index number at 85. It's 80 up in Wapakoneta and Bell Fountain, 83 in Piqua. A little warmer as you head southward towards Eaton at 86 and 85 in Oxford, 85 degrees in Springboro. And here's a forecast of our dew points here through tomorrow morning. You can see those numbers staying mostly into the low to mid 60s. 1 o'clock in the afternoon, low to mid 60s. So those numbers similar to today or maybe a, a touch lower. So even though uh, we'll see those readings into the mid 80s, should be a pretty comfortable day, although uh, just a touch on the humid side. Future track forecast tonight showing dry conditions. As a matter of fact, skies clear out as we go through the night, setting the stage for that potential for some patchy fog tomorrow morning. But otherwise, it looks like a pretty nice day tomorrow, partly to mostly sunny skies around the Miami Valley. And even though there's a very slight chance of an isolation, Shower looks like that chance will stay mostly to the south and west of us throughout the day. Forecast tonight mostly clear skies heading down to 64, 72 at 11 o'clock, 69 at 1 o'clock in the morning, and then that chance for a little fog around 5 a.m. 65 and 65 under mostly sunny skies at 7 o'clock, up to 85 degrees tomorrow afternoon. Look for plenty of sunshine, partly to mostly sunny skies through the day, and our Storm Team 2 seven day forecast back into the upper 80s over the weekend. Rain chances rising too most likely in the afternoon and evening hours. Hot for Monday and Tuesday, but a cold front comes through. That may set the stage for some nice weather heading toward the 4th of July.